why, why, why do I want to be DJ? Yes, it's hard because you get a big head and you're somebody. Yeah, you're a DJ and MSC DJ is kind of prestigious. Prestigious. You know, I'm, I'm not at KLH or KTI. I don't know. I'm at one of the greatest alternative rock stations, you know, in the Midwest, I think. Mm -hmm. You know? And yeah, it does give you a big head. But I mean, so then I get deflated, so why do I do it? Because I like the music. It's the music. Uh, it's really nothing special, you're not like uh, uh, a celebrity or anything like that. You're just doing your job. But my friends, they, they find it somewhat exciting. Not, not really, my sister finds it exciting, but uh, I, I tend not to tell people I'm a DJ. Music. Music. Semi-professional. Nobody expects anything more. <laughs> Town rats. So that's part of, yeah, that's one of the main reasons I'm here. It's because of the music. If it wasn't because of the music, if I was doing this with Paul Abdul and CNC Music Factory and stuff like that, I have to get paid pretty big bucks. Oh yeah, but you I wouldn't pick out this music. I'd have them pay pay me because I'd have them set it up for my lunch. You know, so and I wouldn't even do that. So it's more fun picking out your music, playing what you want. That's the way radio stations should run, but of course, it doesn't work with marketing. What? I don't like goddamn over the air. Is that it? Connect your goddamn dots! Fire it off, fire it off. Sometimes you mess up on the air, but as you know, the best of us always mess up on the air. <laughs> so what are you looking at? Usually it's a little more weirder. I usually, uh, I mean, I don't want to say this, but I play like good stuff like that. When it's three normal here, I'd be jumping around. I turn up all the steering and I jump around. That's the thing I do. I'm much like Stephanie, but now there's, you know, in, in my place. Yeah. I'm a little more. But that only for like a few songs, not the whole show. Okay. Just why I do. If you don't tune in, you'll sometimes hear me breathing heavy. And that's because I was jumping around. Well, what should I pull out with my shadow in vain? Midnight to like 1 30, 2 o'clock is like people listen really big time, okay? But then like 1 30, 2 o'clock to 3, to like 4 or 5, mm. it really drops off, you know? Because if I open the request lines, they'll be ringing from midnight to like 2. But after that, forget it. I can bet I can name on call, so. I haven't opened the request lines yet though since I'm back from the summer. I'm afraid to, I'm lazy. Behind the scenes, they don't see me frantically scrambling for a, a promotion, uh, a cart, or a CD, or trying to start something, or, or screwing up. They just hear the music coming out of the station. They don't know what's going on here. I could be naked. They wouldn't know. Well, you wouldn't know because you have the camera here. I'll make it under my clothes. Well, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fully clad here at MSC. 
we have a nudity room. No, we don't have a nudity room. You probably, you probably could do a show in the nude. I don't think anyone would care. You have to pull the blinds or close the door and make sure no one stops by for a visit. No man knows the day or the hour. I can't get the fucking camera here! Get her! <laughs> you are listening to 91.7 WMSC in Milwaukee and on the Milwaukee School of Engineering campus. My name is Rick. This is has been and will always be B-Side Radio. Yeah, I'm a DJ.